gold. Hey everybody, Patrick here from Gold Bio, your source for proven, published, and affordable reagents. Check out our website, goldbio.com, for all your lab needs, along with helpful protocols and informative articles. Speaking of informative articles, I'm here with our staff writer, Rebecca, who's going to talk to you about using Evernote for your electronic lab notebook. Hi, my name is Rebecca Talley, and I'm a staff writer here at Gold Bio. I'm also a medical student at the University of Missouri. Today we're going to talk to you about how you can set up Evernote as your electronic lab notebook. Are you ready? Let's get started! Okay, so before we get started, let's go ahead and start ta by talking about what an electronic lab notebook actually is. An electronic lab notebook is exactly what it sounds like. It is your lab notebook. It's an electronic form of it, and it can essentially replace your handwritten notes if you'd like it to, or you can use it to supplement your handwritten notes. Um, Evernote has become a very popular electronic lab notebook, especially with life scientists, um, basically because it's free in its basic form, and it's also easy to learn, easy to use, and it's very accessible since there's a Windows version, a Mac version, a web-based version, and also um, mobile applications available to download on your mobile devices. So what makes electronic lab notebooks so great is that they're searchable and organizable. So you can go ahead and ditch your scissors and your glue because you'll be able to add your pictures, data, graphs, and charts directly into your electronic lab notebook. You don't have to worry about pasting them and cutting them out and all sorts of things like that. Um, electronic lab notebooks are also great because you can collaborate with your colleagues and lab mates and go ahead and share your notebook with them in Evernote or through emails in a variety of ways and then you can um, work on your experiments together more efficiently and easier than working with the traditional paper lab notebook that you'd have to actually pass around. So that's what makes Evernote great. Um, before we get started on the videos, I'd like you to go ahead and make your account. Go ahead and click the link to go to evernote.com and set up your account. All you'll need is an email address. And go ahead and get that set up before moving on to video two. Thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about how to use Evernote as your electronic lab notebook, check out the other videos in this series. If you liked what you saw, be sure to subscribe or check us out on Facebook and Twitter. Don't forget to visit goldbio.com for all of your research needs. See you next time.